Hello everybody, Jody Ann Johnson here with the 93rd episode of Coffee with Jody. I am a people champion and strategist, and I'm talking today with you about the month of July, picnics, engagement, celebrating our employees, and our oceans. So picture this, you're outside, it's a barbecue, Maybe you've got a Spanish mackerel on the grill, or maybe you even have hamburgers and hot dogs, but you're outside celebrating with family, celebrating with your team members in your office, maybe your clients. Picnic is a French word that started back in the 1800s with alfresco dining. So a bottle of wine, a loaf of bread, some cheese and some fruit, and it was a meal. Obviously, here in America, we've taken picnics to a whole other level. And enjoying the outdoors is a really good way to get some sunshine, some vitamin D, and to be in fresh air. A lot of us were missing that during the pandemic. Now with the rise in Delta variants and COVID back up again, Please be sure to wear your masks indoors, and if you've been vaccinated, it's probably okay to be outdoors without your mask, but nevertheless, please be careful. July is also the onset of National Fishing Month. It starts on July the 24th and goes through the 30th of August, and that's important to me because that's what my son does. He's a big game fisherman. He's out at a marlin tournament right now on his way up to Maryland for a white marlin tournament, and he loves the sea. He did as a small child, and I do as well, being born here in Miami. The ocean and the Biscayne Bay are just a really big part of our life down here. And our oceans, they're at risk, as you know, from pollution, um, chemicals, oil spills, all manner of man-made um, injury to the oceans. However, we also found that when people were not out so much during COVID, our, our oceans got healthier, our bays got healthier, our lakes got healthier. So there's a lot that we can do. This particular issue is a, around the United Nations Sustainable Development Goal number 14, which is life below the sea. If you go to the UN's Sustainable Development site, you can find a number of different ways that people are working to get our oceans healthier, which is a lifeblood of all of humanity, all of you know, our oxygen, our water, they're related to the seas. So it's a very, very important UN Sustainable Development Goal. And it's also a source of great joy and fun. As we look at the month of July around independence and freedom, as I've said in previous videos, it comes with freedom and independence, a great deal of responsibility. So we as business leaders, can take that charge, can really make a difference, whether it's for our team members and celebrating them and really engaging them in the business and in its clients and in its purpose, but also making our communities more sustainable. I hope you'll join me and the people on our team in finding ways to increase the sustainability in and around your office, in and around your life, and in and around your community. Enjoy the remaining days of July, and we'll see you next month in August for more on engagement and a very special issue on rescue dogs. If you liked and enjoyed this video, please share it, like it, and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And if you'd like to find out more about how business coaching can support you in your business goals, please click on the calendar link below and schedule a discovery call with me.